Welcome back everyone. Thanks so much for watching. Please remember, if you enjoy the video, please give it a like. And if you could help us on our journey towards 100 subscribers, that would be really good. We have had another couple in the last two days, so we are getting there. But if you want to join us, please subscribe. It would really help. Thank you. That's enough of my plug. Okay, now, if you remember, we were in the Seamoth room. Seamoth? See, not Seamoth. What am I talking about? Prawn suit room. We've done all our scanning. We've got the uh, rocket blueprint from the captain's cabin but I remember a couple of things when we legged it out and I think there was a room that we didn't go into that was on fire so I just want to check if we had gone to every room and no we haven't there you gone go. to every room so I thought we'd have a quick look in here just in case oh, oh little, but I saw that coming back it didn't oh I'm out of fuel that's why We'll have to go back here. Where did we get the... There was one in the canteen. Yeah, there's one in. There it is. So can we just... I don't really want to keep that one, so... Is there a bin? Uh, you throw it in the bin? Yeah, there is a kind of bin, <laughs> but I think you can just drop it. Yeah. Cool, 100%. That's what we want. It's coming back. It's from the vent, isn't it? That's what it is. Yeah, well, I just I think. think it's I, I think um, if you leave them, I think they start to spread again. Mm. I'm probably going to come in here and find. Oh no, 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 no! Look, here we go. Integrating new PDA more water. Now, what's that? Is <laughs> it's another battery. You want the battery? I don't know. Let's have a look. <laughs> and who we got? Oh, I don't know. Uh, no, no. I'm going to take a chance that we don't need it. Oh. There's another one. And another one. <laughs> Wait, can you actually look? Pick up. I don't really want to pick up the bag. Yeah, I don't think you can go I in it, can think, you? Yeah, I'm going to leave it. I don't think I really want it. Okay, so that's that sorted. Nothing particularly of interest, except, of course, uh, going the wrong way. Where are we going? Here we go. Right. Back down here. OK, at the end of the last video, I said that there was a way out of this room rather than going back the way you came. But it was a little tricky. After having a, a bit of a look around and uh, it all came back to me, it actually isn't too bad if you know exactly where to go. Which is basically... Through here, we'll find our way through this gap though into the corner. There we go. So now, if you follow this through without getting electrocuted, you should find that you can go all the way down the side and up here. All oh, right, so right to the corner and then along the side. Yeah, it's just a case of. Uh, sticking to the very edge. Now I don't think we can get out of there though. Try to remember now what we do. Okay. This is a fun room. And I think we will the old seam sea moth. Sea fly going. That was it yeah. Here we go. So I believe this is where you get the black box data. Integrating new PDA data. Yes, indeed. That's a good job. We've got our old. Uh, laser cutter. to eat something. I want one of those. I can't even use a can opener properly, <laughs> so that would come really, really in ha handy when I have tuna and stuff. Yeah, okay, where are we going to have to go around <laughs> eat one of these blocks? Vital uh, signs, stabilising. Well, let's grab a bit of that. Okay, so 
we need a code and we don't want to get electrocuted. There we go. Lab access. Integrating new PDA data. Now you can go. I don't think there's anything to Instagram. You can actually go straight out through there, but you do miss a couple of little bits. So what we want to do is we want to go into here, data downloads, codes and clues, lab access, and there we go. 6483. Right, so go to the... Oh, God, I'll It's not easy uh, doing this when you're moving up and down. Six, four... Eight, three. There we go. It's like trying to get cash out when you've been for a drink at the <laughs> mini bank, isn't it? Yes. We've all been there. Yes. Have you? I've been there. <laughs> yeah. Integrating new PDA data. Just need to top up on the old oxygen. God, how did you do that? Well, I just knew there was a, a bit of air there. Okay, I don't think there's anything else in here. Oh, no, 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 no. There's another data download. New blueprint acquired. Oh, repulsion cannon. The bank corruption was detected on your PDA. Your technology blueprints have been updated. Oh, okay. Not sure what that actually means. Does that mean she's made them better? I hope so. Hmm. Okay, nothing to scan, so I think we are good to go. Right, so we can't actually get out this way. You come into the lab, but then I've oh, got a uh, good job, we've got plenty of batteries. Uh, you still have to go this way because it's the only way to go up. I'll try and jump out of here. Go. Oh, hell. God, what happened in there? Just a... <laughs> Thank you, that's done. Right. That was a bad one. Okie dokie. Oh, look. Yeah, very helpful on the other <laughs> side of the fire. Right, so we need to... The old... Chuck that down there. No, I don't want you. I want that box. You know, you can hear the crabs on the other side. Yeah, you can. Actually, knock it on it. <laughs> there you go. That's you dead. Is it dead? No, I don't think it is dead. Quick, run! I'd like you to put a crate on it. <laughs> right, so I think we can... Oh, you little bugger. He's not actually got me, is he? But... Um... Shoot back to the old Seamoth. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you very much. And let's head on back. It'd be nice if she could say, Welcome aboard, Captain. Have you had a good day? Yes. So you could say, No, it was shit. <laughs> <laughs> a really shitty day. <laughs> yes, I've had better. Crashed on an alien planet. Pretty much everybody seems dead. And I'm left on my own to build stuff. And now you've also said, that I owe you three million credits. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm having a brilliant day. And it's dark. Which is never great. Oh, that looks like a sand shark. Where are you, sand shark? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, easy. Is that a bit of... Uh... Oh, you little bugger. I'll tell you what, we'll leave you need that. a bit of anger management, they do, yes. don't they? Yeah, they're, they're, they're quite angry, those sand sharks. Oh, daylight. There you go, look. You know how you like the sunrise? Oh. There you go. Sunrise. Well, that was a hunk of burning hell, wasn't it? Next, next to a fantastically burnt out nearly exploding all over the planet and killing everything. Spaceship.
on with that. Okay, so if you look in the bottom right hand corner you'll see that our energy for the seamoth is getting low and you can recharge them with a power cell which i don't know whether we can make at the moment i don't think you need masses of stuff to uh, to make one but the other way to do it is to create what's called a moon pool which you attach i don't actually think you have to attach but it normally goes with your habitat and uh, it allows you to literally place the sea moth and the prawn suit inside it. Oh, just bit me. I don't know. Let's turn the lights off. Save a bit of energy. Something got me. And of course, we have a radio message. So we'll do that first. Send a rescue ship all the way out there. So Aurora, you're just gonna have to meet us halfway. We've uploaded blueprints to the ship's We're computer. Doing a sandwich run, you in? Uh, yeah. Give me a second. Black box data shows the high security terminal in the captain's quarters is still functional. Becky's uh, leaving like in five minutes. All right. Well, tell Becky I'll just take the the regular. Regular. Yeah, she'll know what I mean. The code should and be. If she doesn't. Just tell her the regular, dude. Okay. The if code. I say regular, and she's like, "What's the regular?" I can come all the way back up here. The code should be two six seven nine. Regular ship to ham and cheese. Okay, would you just say ham and cheese? Ham and cheese. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, there you go. So that was the code that luckily I already knew. Uh, that came a little bit late for us, but that doesn't matter. They're on their game, aren't they? They are. Yeah. Well, late game. <laughs> Okie dokie. So we need to have a look at a couple of bits. One is the power cell, so we could actually make a power cell. Do you have any batteries? <laughs> oh, funny. <laughs> very, very funny. Uh, I have batteries. I've just got nowhere to put them. <laughs> Everywhere's bloody full. Right, so let's have a little look. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Let's have a go. We have got storage now, of course, in our habitat. So we could maybe put right. So this that's a full battery. So that's a dead battery. So we'll put that in there, and that's a dead battery. So we'll put that in there. Uh, we've got a storage module for Seamoth um, or the prawn suit, and we've got all this stuff, which really we have absolutely no use for at the moment. And of course, we've still got the arcade gorge toy. Anybody well, comments, that's... please? Tell me what the hell this thing is. I've got no idea. Right. Uh, we need to. I've got rid of yeah. I'm going to put a little bit of space. Uh, let's just quickly check in here if we've got some silicon rubber in here. Silicon rubber. No. Okay. I should have checked when I was already outside. But never mind. And that is titanium only. And that is. No. Not in there either. We haven't got silicon rubber either. Right. So okay. what do you make that with? Can you remember? Yeah, silicon rubber is the, um, what should we call it? Uh, the creep vines, which we can get quite easily from down here. <laughs> Crashed. Anything we just want to do is watch out for old uh, angry stalker. And we need to put on knife. Oh! oh. Hey, that's just not nice, is it? Are you getting that fire extinguisher out again? <laughs> Deadly weapon, the fire extinguisher. Okay, yeah, I'm full, yeah, I know. Okay, right, okay, come on, let's go back. Before I get eaten by another stalker. To be fair, though, there's, there aren't that many things you can use to protect yourself in that way, is there? No, so no. you probably would get the fire extinguisher out and oh, give it a good old be, knock. Yeah. Well, to be fair, if you squirted it in its face, <laughs> uh, I, I don't think they take too. Have you tried? Is it, does it let you? I don't think you can use it underwater. That's the problem. Okay, so that should give us no. That gives us fibre mesh. So it's actually the clusters that we need. Right. With okay. what? With the actual? Yeah. yeah. That's fine. We just need to uh, pull things on. Yeah. We just need to go back. I mean, having one of these is not a bad idea, but 
it's not going to be as useful. Just check the direction again. Yep, it is this way. Let's see if we can do this again without being eaten by the uh, stalker who seems to be lurking around. You can actually kill. Oh, no. Have that. Thank you. Uh, where are we? Here we go. Some over there. That's a weird looking fish. Is that going to be enough? Yeah, I think that's okay. Drop something. You drop something. I could do that. I, I... Now I know it's that. I don't think I've got any. I don't think I've even got any in the habitat down the uh, down down the road. <laughs> yes. Further down the coast. Down the... the coast, is it? <laughs> you know what I mean. Let's see if we get. I think it's two though. Uh, so that's a very quick. No, I think it was two batteries. Was it two batteries? One silicon rubber. Yeah, okay, that's fine. So what we need to go there, and she will tell you what we do first, is we will do the old titanium. Just go and grab a quick drink. Vital signs stabilizing. We've got plenty of health now. Right. Okay. So, um, similar so batteries, batteries, batteries. I think we've got a couple of batteries in here, haven't we? Yep, yeah, we have indeed. We move that up there, back in here, down there. One power cell. Wow. There we go. And the lovely colour. Very nice, isn't it? Okay. Bright orange one of the thing is uh, obviously one of the uh, more sensible things to now go and get is the fragments for the moon pool um, what have we got in here have we got anything that's uh... right so there's the rebreather so we've got the fiber mesh that's quite useful but we need two silver to make a wiring kit have we got any silver I think silver's one of these things we just keep running out of because it, it isn't. That's the titanium one, isn't it? Yeah, so that's no use. You don't find it every time, do you, silver? No, it's not that much of it. No, I don't want to name the bloody thing. Just want to open it. And no silver in there. But we've got a bit of space, so um, let's have a, a shifty. What can we put in there? Just fill it with titanium. Okay, right. so we need to go and find. What I'll do is I'm going to head in the general direction of the habitat. So that's where we've got some storage. Um, you can see how storage is really important. Yeah. Can you remember when we saw one person online had put um, all their storage and it was all alphabetical. Oh yeah. <laughs> it was very, very good. It was, uh, yeah. It was a, a little bit over the top. But, you can be uh, as organised as you want to be in this yeah. game. <laughs> he must have had... He had hundreds, didn't he? And it was yeah. all alphabetical. Yeah. He had probably about 40 of the large containers. Excuse me. And probably 60 or 80 of the small ones. He's probably like that in real life, you know, like his bedroom's all, his closet, it's perfect. Okay. So there's no legs today. Yeah, it never seems to have legs. I don't really know why, but never mind. Well, I know why. It's been Welcome aboard, Captain. Unknown worlds pop up. Right. Okay. So we've got a bit of spare. Right. So all of the stuff that we collected, including our weird arcade gorge toy, that can go here. The Aurora, the posters. Some nice posters there. Mm. Uh, might as well stick that in there for now because we can't add the um, storage to the sea moth because you need the moon pool and then the 
uh, upgrade console to allow you to actually put upgrades onto vehicles. Mm. So we can't actually put it on the boat. Do you think that gorge toy, I think after you've been here a while, you'd use it as your boyfriend or girlfriend. You'd cuddle it every night, wouldn't you? You get pretty lonely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, who was it in... Uh, I can't remember the name of the film now. Wilson the Ball. <laughs> you know Wilson the Ball? Yeah. Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks. Cast away. Yes. Yeah. Well, this this is Gorge Toy. <laughs> this will be your Gorge <laughs> Toy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Gorge Toy. You oh. can actually find in one of the bases down under the sea, which we will have to go to uh, fairly soon, actually. I can't remember which one it's in, but there's actually a scannable... Markiply the YouTuber toy. Uh, you can actually <laughs> scan it and then uh, we put it above our bed. D don't ask why. We just did. I didn't have anywhere else to put it. Right, I've just realised to put this back in because actually I think because we've made it, we might be able to add that to the Seaboth. Not sure, but I'm going to give it a go and see if we can put it in the accessories uh, little bay on, on the moth. Right, okay, so we've got that. We've emptied some of our storage. And while we're here, obviously, we need to eat. Have a bit of a munchie. Yeah, and uh, actually, I'll tell you what. Because we've got bitten a couple of times by a stalk of our health run down. So, okay, so 74 for the food. We'll have one of those. Oh, a bit of Chinese potato. A bit of Chinese cheese potato, Ooh. as I like to call it. <sighs> Two of them. Like picking cards. If you're a vegetarian, oh. you wouldn't be too bothered, would you? But where are the burger trees? Oh dear, yes. Bad burger trees. Where are the chickens? Okay, so so if you've got too many seeds, if you do what I've just done, which is basically um, try and overfill it, which you can't, you can always just keep the seeds in the storage. And next time, just try and make sure that you eat more and leave it a bit of extra space. Right. Okie dokie. So, uh, what we could do with doing as we are relatively close. We're shooting off down here and just we'll have a quick couple of minutes and see whether we can find some sandstone and get to silver. Because we need that to make the wiring kit so we can make the rebreather. The rebreather basically allows you to utilize oxygen more efficiently at a hundred meters or below. Um, as we need to go to probably between about two and three hundred meters, uh, having the old rebreather would help. And well, there you go. Oxygen efficiency decreased. As I was saying. So, and your oxygen goes down really quickly. Yeah, it just it? goes down more quickly. It's not it's not really, really penal to you, but I'm not gonna bother with that. What I want is sounds. Build for the rounder ones. There you go. Oh, we're going to have to go up. So we know we can go straight back down. Big breath. I said big breath. Oh, I say. <laughs> <laughs> Just hoping I go back to the same place. You go back down, it will be there. <laughs> I'm sure there was two very close together as well. It's there, look. Where? There, straight in front of you. Oh, yes. No, that's not the right one. We want silver. One silver, but we need two. No, that's 
not sandstone. I love the way the plants sandstone. light up, do you, at night? Oh, yeah. I mean, the, the, the plant life in this thing is absolutely astounding. Mm. Well, so is the animal life, to be fair. No, that's not it either. Come on now, be nice to me. There's a spitty fish again. Oh, the spitty fish. What are these? Spitty. Yeah. They don't look. They look very nasty. <laughs> oh, again. Wow, look at that. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Reefback. There we go again. Okay, right. One more silver. One hundred meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. No. Silver! Yay! Time to go back. Do you know what this area is called? Um, There's no map, is there, for this game? No, well, not in the game. Yes, that's yeah. That's an interesting point. Um, obviously, people online, and I'm assuming with a bit of assistance from unknown worlds, have sort of released a map but it's not in the game it's the only game I've ever played where you don't get a map you just and and not even a map that starts and grows you know so you start off with it just uh, revealing the shadows to you and then as you go to the different biomes uh, it increases so that you can see new areas that you've explored you just don't get a map full stop which uh, overall is a brilliant idea but it, it, it can be a little bit frustrating well, you just have to play with your wits don't you you do remembering where you found things yeah, you've got to all remember. the time the compass helps a little bit because mm. obviously you can remember which directions that you've gone in um so that you know oh, mind you oh do another one come on then we'll do the radio first i always get told off for not doing the radio this is life pod four we've landed close to the aurora Flotation device is active, but we've got some big old fish in the water with us, and I don't know how long we're going to last. We're close to the crash site, so bring radiation protection. Four out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. Hmm. You going to bother? Okay. Uh, well, I'd, uh, pro probably not in the short term, no. let's be honest. They're probably dead anyway. It's dog eat dog in this world. <laughs> Fight yes. your own fish. <laughs> Or fish eat human Survival in this Survival of the fittest. Yes. Or is it the selfish? Uh, selfish or, or... Shellfish. Shellfish. <laughs> Very good. Uh, we don't need the radiation suit anyway because obviously we now have managed to turn the radiation off. So I think what we will do next time is obviously we will make the rebreather and we will head off to find the fragments to make the moon pool, which will help uh, vastly because it means we can keep the old seam off fully charged without having to take having to create a power cell every single time so thank you very much for watching don't forget i know i say it every time but if you like it please give us a like and even put a comment because it all helps promote the video which helps promote the channel and please if you could help us out and subscribe and get us towards that 100 it would be greatly appreciated thanks very much have a good day or night game preacher out mm -hmm.